Crack TV. I'm Megan. And I'm Brandon. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is Tuesday, February 15th, and here's what's happening at Great Oak today. In the wake of quarantines and pandemics, the performing arts have been struggling to find their audience. However, our school's color guard continues to go strong. When I joined, we only had one sophomore in, on the team, so 10 seniors, four juniors, I believe, in the fall season, and only one sophomore. So there's just that giant gap, and now there's 10 freshmen, and the middle school camp had a lot of recruits. So we're hoping next fall season there will be even more freshmen. Color Guard continues to practice and perform as usual, and despite the restrictions, are able to dedicate a large amount of time to their passions. Calling off performing groups. Are you interested in competing against other skillful performing groups? Consider competing at Breakdown 2020-22, a performing arts competition and fundraiser held by the National Honor Society. They're looking particularly for dancers and singers. If you have any questions, reach out to an NHS officer or include it in your interest form. Now a message from peer leaders. This week is Healthy Relationship Week and today's focus is on self-love. Self-love means accepting yourself in the moment as you are and it is an essential part of life. Take some time today to think about something that is important to you. Hey Wolfpack, we're here with our fascinating freshman. I'm Zach Shoke on Varsity Water Bowl. How long have you been playing for? Six months. What did you interested in school? I thought it looked interesting and I wanted to try it. What's your favorite thing about me? My favorite thing about Zach is his uh, work ethic. He works really good. Actually, he's a uh, smart player in the water. Big impact on our program, being a freshman playing uh, on our school. Bye, Bye Wolfpack! Welcome to South Spotlight and today we are here with Mr. LaCour. Hello. What position do you have at Great Oak High School? I'm currently the assistant principal of behavior and supervision. All right. Do you have any advice for the students at Great Oak? I do. Um, get involved in as much as possible. Uh, enjoy uh, the experience at Great Oak High School because it's going to be a great one. How does your experience here at Great Oak compare to your experience at High School? Well, my experience here is quite different. I attended high school at Rubino High School. Thanks to Mr. LaCour for participating in Staff Spotlight. Welcome back to another episode of Cornball Activity of I. Happy Black Heritage Month. Let's go. I gotta ask you a question, G. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, get that V line. Yeah, you see that? Yeah. You see that? Uh -huh. All right, all right. An airplane crashes on the border of Canada, United States. Where do you bury the survivors? What? Today I'm here with Billy Bob. An airplane crashes on the border of Canada and the United States. Where do you bury the survivors? Bury the survivors. Well, you won't believe this, vibe, but you don't bury survivors. <laughs> That's right. That's it for today, Wolfpack. That's all for today, Wolfpack. Have a great oak day.